Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. I am Shantae and in this video, I am doing a wash and go. I'm about to get ready for dinner, so I gotta make this quick. I'm freshly washed and I'm about to put on my gloves because I, I like to use gloves. I don't like product buildup on my hands, like just having gel and stuff in between my fingers, it just irks me. Before we go any further, let me not forget to <laughs> invite you to hit that subscribe button. You thought I almost forgot. <laughs> that was cute, that was cute. If you are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, come join our channel. We do a little bit of everything, mostly it's hair, but sometimes I dabble in other things I ain't got no business doing. <laughs> you know, come join the family, we'd love to have you. And to all of my returning subscribers, hey mama, hey bestie, hey friend, how you doing sis? How you doing, girl? I hope you're doing good, okay? Because I'm doing great. So my husband, you know what? I'm, I'm feeling for some steak. And he was just like, oh, okay, well, what about our kids? I said, what about them? <laughs> so how y'all been doing? You know, I feel like I haven't sat down and talked in a minute. I've been doing a little bit of everything. I've been working on some affiliate uh, links for you guys so y'all can shop with me. If you follow me on Instagram, hey, baby, okay? If you don't, you definitely need to hit that link in my description box and go ahead and uh, follow me on Instagram. I do a lot more up-to-date, real-life stuff over there. It's really pissing me off. I can't part my hair. The last style that I just washed out was a wash-and-go, so that probably explains why she a little tangled because towards the ends of my wash-and-goes, I start throwing her into a hot puff. I'm just adding a little bit more water back to her because I like my hair to be damp when I do my wash and goes. To me, I get the best definition when my hair is somewhat damp. And then I'm gonna take this one section and break it down into probably about three, three to four more sections. I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my Camille Rose. This is the Curl Love Leave-In Conditioner. It smells really soft and pretty. It's not very pungent. Pungent, I think that's the word I'm looking for. It's very lightweight cream. I used it on uh, all of my girl's hair. You mix the wrong kind of leave-in cream or conditioner with the gel, it can kind of like mix in with the gel very nasty and you get this like terrible residue. If you haven't noticed, my ladies are missing in the background. I plan on painting my room, y'all. I'm gonna get rid of the two-tone color and go for something more neutral. I like to go in first with a pink comb. This is very long comb that makes sure that I get through the entire section of my hair. I'm not missing anything in the middle. And I like to go in this first because it helps me get rid of, you know, most of my big knots. And then I go behind it with my detangling brush because it's gonna smooth it out for me and make sure I get any other leftover knots in. So for my gel, I'm gonna go in with another Camille Rose product. This is the Curl Maker. I have been using this gel for probably about two years now as far as my washing goes. And I love it on myself. For me, I have never missed with this product. It has always given me the desired look that I want for my wash and go. So don't worry about it. If it's white casting a little bit, it's fine. But if it starts like coagulating on your strands where it doesn't like it's mixing, you might have an issue. <laughs> you might have an issue. Now I'm gonna go in with my Texture ID and this is the Thermal Styling Mousse. Now I've been using this since I've began my YouTube journey back in 2019. And this product has always been hands down the best foam I have ever used. It's so thick and luxurious feeling. And then it definitely adds that extra layer of definition to my wash and go. And look at that. And it also elongates. And that's what I love the most. And the fact that it's a thermal protectant is great because I like to use heat on my wash and goes to kind of help seal everything up and to help my hair absorb it in. And look at that. Look, look at that. The definition is definitely there. And of course, since we use foam, it's definitely white now, but it's not coagulating. It's just foam trying to settle into the strands. All right, just like that, I am done with the first section. So I didn't really go into details about my pumps and how many like I'm using. So I'm gonna do that on this section. I apologize. Oh, okay, got gel on my robe. That's what she's looking like right now. She's kind of shrunk a little bit, but she's still very much keeping the length on her. And that is why I love combining these two products together. I told my husband I was gonna be done in 30 minutes. Did, did he believe me? I don't know. If he did, he is such a sweet husband because I swear I'd just be pulling them numbers out my ass. We're heading into June and it's still very much chilly. I ain't complaining though because I'm not ready to see that summer heat just yet anyway. Like everybody on my Instagram talking about some sundress season. I'm just like, where, honey? Because I ain't experienced it yet. Where y'all at? 
All right, now for my gel, I'm going to go in with three pumps for this section because this section is pretty big. I usually go in between three or four pumps. It depends on the section. You can definitely overdo it with this gel and it can kind of like get a little gunky and you don't, you don't want those problems. You don't want those problems. For my foam, I'm going to go in with one pump and this just kind of like helps clump the hair together a little bit better. And then I kind of finger shingle it to get the small strands of definition. And then I've been going back to the gym too, y'all. I'm so proud of me. I mean, it's been a month now. I've been going to the gym for a whole month. And I am just elated with myself. The goal is to try to get off of my blood pressure pill, if possible. Because I do have a lot of heart disease in my family. So it's not... It's not weird that I am on high blood pressure pills at this age, but I don't want to be on them. I plan on being around to see some great, great, great grandchildren, okay? That's how long I plan on being around. I don't know about y'all, but I plan on being around to talk. Hey with. friends, a quick ad break real quick. So I recently joined the Express Style Editor Program where I bring y'all cute Express outfits and clothing that are absolutely my fave. And I wanna share these with links for you to also be able to purchase these items that I show off because I am a fashion girly. I love cute clothes. Cute clothes help you feel good and great throughout the day. And who don't wanna feel like that? So this link will be provided right above in the tight right hand corner or down below in the description box all right y'all i'm down to the last piece amen so it took me 30 minutes just to do my hair <laughs> all right so to uh, blow uh, dry my hair i'm going in with my shark blow dryer i've had this for like a year now i think it's been a year now and i love this thing it's so small and lightweight and it's powerful and it's quiet I purchased it off of Amazon. Love this damn thing. So I have it tagged in my Amazon storefront. It's under my hair care tools and accessories. I'm in a hurry. I'm not about to use that diffuser because it takes too long. I'm gonna just use it like this and I'm gonna put it on medium heat with a low force. got her semi dry she is still a little damp especially in my back because that's where my hair is the thickest but I'm for the most part cool most of the white has bit, desiccated it's, kind of, it's not hey, too much kind of heat it right now and i'm gonna do my makeup while she's cooling off and then i'm gonna come back and finish it up here's the hair she's pretty much dried i did mist her with a little bit of oil to help with the white casting a little bit until it's completely dry because since she's still a little wet you still see a little bit of the gel residue this lasts me four days which is about my regular work week so by the time the weekend and stuff is coming around i'm putting it in a high puff and i'm doing my next wash and go over time she'll get a little bit more fuller at the roots and get more volume but the definition looks really really good and it's not super hard and crunchy and it definitely has body she got she got body <laughs> she does and she looks amazing so yeah that is it for this video guys thank you for joining us on another one we greatly appreciate having you here on our get ready with me we will see y'all on another one be blessed and be safe